YouTubers, A. Hatley here. I am, I think I'm going to do a tutorial. I roller set my hair last Saturday. It came out. Um, like I said, it's a couple of days old, so it's starting to get a little frizzy. Um, it's not as defined as it was, however, it is. I still kind of like it. I like it afro -er. I'm getting used to it being afro-y. Um, it's all shrunk up, but so this is it. If you like it, stay tuned. So what I used in order to do my roller set, and actually in the front, because I knew I was going to pull it back, I didn't roll back. I braided it. I had, I think, three braids across. You'll see in the video in just a minute. But I had braids going across, and then I had rollers on the side. And I use these size rollers. They're the same size, just different colors. I've had them forever. Bought them in two separate packages. <clears throat> but they're both the same size. I don't know. Maybe that's a quarter. A little less than a quarter of an inch diameter. I don't know. Um, but I use those rollers all over my head. And after I put on my Apogee Leave-In Protein Conditioner, I set my hair. I used um, QP Elasta Mango Butter um, and moisturized my sections. And then... I use Cantu Shea Butter in order to roller set my hair. Um, and that's pretty much it. I slept in the satin cap and continue sleeping in the satin cap. I'll probably use some gel and tighten this up. I haven't put any gel on my hair yet, um, but I probably will because I think I want my edges a little bit more slick. But, um, tutorial to follow. <laughs>